stampers welcome to another watch it weekly wednesday i'm aubrey part of the stamp and jill creative team and today i wanted to share with you a fun layout idea that you can use using any pattern paper i like to use stampin up's dsp designer series paper because it's such good quality and it's two-sided and it coordinates so well with the cardstock as well so with this card you can use any three by four piece of scrap designer series paper or pattern paper, whatever you have, any that's two-sided, okay? So this is my three by four piece that I'm using and I'm just going to take my Stampin' Up! trimmer and I'm gonna trim it down um, just in half um, on the four side, so to two, so you have two two inch pieces, two by three inch. And then I'm gonna take each of these pieces and trim off one inch on both, okay? Just like that. So I end up having two two by two pieces and two two by one pieces, okay? Now this layout is super, super simple. All I'm gonna do is take my pieces and kind of layer them on my page so they're kind of in a rectangle, but using the different sides. Now you could use the same sides if you wanted, or you could use other DSP, bring it in if you like a different pattern better. But this is just one way to use just that little simple three by four piece of paper. So cute. Okay, so that's how you lay it out. So now I'm gonna adhere it together. I'm gonna use Stampin' Sill. And I like to lay it all the way out how I'm gonna um, adhere it down before I adhere it so that I know exactly where I want my pieces to go. Now, you can do this a lot of different ways. I generally like to have the same amount of space all the way around on my card, okay? So I am just going to pick up one piece and put my adhesive on and then put it right back down in its spot. And I do it just one piece at a time like this so that I know where my other pieces are going to go. Okay. Just like that, okay? Such a simple layout, and then you can add any um, saying or design that you want on top of that. Let me show you a few of the cards that I've made using this layout idea. So here's one with that paper that I used, and I just did a little simple happy birthday. Very simple, super easy, but so cute. Here's another one, anything is possible. I love this with the hand-penned stamp set and that DSP. And then, thanks. So pretty with that expressions and in ink paper. So fun. I love this layout idea. It's something that, it's kind of a go-to layout idea that I use for my cards. So I hope that you can use it too. If you have any questions or comments, make sure to post them below and make sure to visit us at stampinjill.com. Thanks so much for watching. We'll see you next week for another Watch It Weekly Wednesday.